Hi, my name is Layla, and I run the blog What Layla Loves. Welcome to my YouTube channel and my very, very first YouTube video. <laughs> Thank you so much for stopping by on my channel. I'm going to focus on fashion, beauty, lifestyle, and home decor. I hope you'll stick around, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you get to know when I upload a new video. Enjoy! I am in transition as far as my body and my weight. I have at my highest been 215 pounds, at my optimum weight of 130 pounds. I now stand in front of you at 185 pounds. What I wanted to document is me transitioning, not necessarily like losing weight, but more trying to style the wardrobe that I have. I have no intentions on buying clothes for each and every size <laughs> that I go down to and each time that I lose weight. So I'm trying to make what I have in my wardrobe work for me by styling um, the best that I can looks with what I have. Now I will add pieces here and there into my wardrobe and I'll share this. I will share with those with you guys for sure. But I thought that it would be interesting to document. Um, I haven't seen anything like this being done so I thought I would be the first one to do it because as spring is now coming, actually it is completely spring, however we are um, in quarantine, which I hope you're all safe and well. Um, I thought it was interesting because I pulled out clothes out of my wardrobe and started to try to put together looks that I could wear without buying too much because it would just be a waste of money because I intend on going back to my optimum size. So I have a bunch of clothes that don't fit because they're too small. I have clothes that fit and then I have another section of clothes that don't fit because they're too big and I'm gonna give those away and donate. And um, so I thought it would be fun to kind of style what I have and what fits me right now as I am at 185 pounds. And it kind of forces you to work with kind of like a capsule wardrobe just because you're working with what fits and then trying to add pieces that will complement what you already have to the to your closet. At least that's what I'm trying to do. So if you do enjoy, please subscribe and um, Let's get into it. The very first piece I'm going to style, and that's what I'm going to style with you for you guys today, is these pants, these pleated pants. And I bought these because one, they're stretchy, two, as you can see, they're pleated, and they were kind of like a good option um, for pants that were comfortable. I got them last summer, but I believe they're still available. I'll link everything I can. If I don't find something, I will link dupes or lookalikes for them. But I hope that this serves for inspiration for what you already have in your closet and in your wardrobe. Um, so I'm going to style these pants for you and I'm going to style them five ways with things that I already own in my wardrobe. And if you guys like this, we could keep going. Um, so let's do this. All right, let's get started with look number one. I'm wearing this with a black cami. Um, this is a really cute evening look with some strappy sandals and a bomber jacket. This is my absolute, absolute favorite combo. Um, it might just be my favorite outfit of all of them. I don't know what you guys think. I love, 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 love this. And I love um, that the bomber picks up on the color of the pants. Yeah. This bomber jacket is no longer available. It was a, a Who What Wear from Target or from Who What Wear by Target. <laughs> uh, but I will link something similar. Um, down below. Now this is exactly why I love style. It is not where you buy it, it is not how much it costs, it's what you do with it. This shirt right here was meant to be a pajama shirt. I got it at the clearance section, our Target, last year I think for $9 towards the end of summer. Number one, look at that print. When you run across something like that, it doesn't matter what it's labeled as, you do what you want with it and for me this shirt has turned into one of my favorite spring summer shirts ever. The print, um, the, the striped pocket, just perfect. You know what they say, when in doubt, pair it with denim. Well, if they don't say it, they should say it. I'm saying it, so now you can say it. When in doubt, pair it with denim. I love this outfit and I think it's a perfect muted pair and I love that it looks just as good with heels as it does with sneakers or is it there with the way around? Yeah, it looks just as good with sneakers as it does with 
heels as you're about to find out. Um, I really love this one too. <laughs> What's your guys' favorite? Let me you know. know. Is it just me or does this shade of denim call for something white? Anytime I have this shade of denim, whether a shirt or jeans, which I actually do and we'll style them in a later video, um, I always feel like the shade of denim calls for, I'm sorry I'm touching my hair so much. Um, thank God I'm not wearing lip gloss. <laughs> It calls for white, it calls for white something. I wanted to show you all how we look styled with heels and with some kind of flats, be it sneakers or loafers or whatever it may be. You guys, what's your favorite with the heels or the sneakers? I can't fake, I like them both. I guess it depends on the occasion, right? What's your favorite? Tell me, tell me down below. Heels or sneakers with this outfit? What do you guys think about this look? A little preppy, a little cool. Um, I've been trying to figure out what to do with my cardigans and I have a lot of them from years and years back and they're pretty good quality. They're just not that trendy anymore and I thought that wearing one um, and ruching the sleeves up and wearing it with these pleated pants and these shoes would kind of give them a little bit of a cool factor. Um, I added these pearl clips because I love them. I don't care what anybody says. And I think it just makes it a little more modern what do you guys think? Would you wear it like this? I'll show you how it looks with some heels too. I noticed while I was editing that my cardigan is gap is uh, like gapping a little bit in the chest area and I would just add a safety pin to fix that. Oh yes, get into it. This is basically a two color outfit, which is always so chic and sophisticated, especially when you can throw in like a print that's in the same shades and remains muted. Um, love it, love it, love it. What do you guys think? Every woman has in their wardrobe a white button down shirt of some variety, whether it's a cotton one, a collarless one like mine, but we all have some kind of basic white shirt and they are just a no-brainer to style and so i thought i would end with this um what do you guys think what do you guys think of the look so far i really like this and i actually have worn this with some flats too and i'll show you guys I love accessories and I chose to accessorize the of this outfit with a pair of sunglasses like the others and a pearl headband which again I just love if you would like to see more of these videos give me a thumbs up um, subscribe, turn on the notification bell, and share this video if you think it will be helpful for somebody else. Let me know which look was your favorite, and I will see you in my very next video. Thank you so much for watching. And follow me on Instagram. Um, I will link everything that I can find available down below. If not, I will, I will link similar items. However, um, let this video serve as inspiration. Whatever it is you have in your wardrobe right now, something can work for you, and you can find ways to style it to make it work for you while you're in transition right now. Um, thank you so much for spending time with me and I will catch you on the next style series. Bye.